Hey everybody, welcome back. This video, we're going to be talking about a new cryptocurrency. So we've been working with Bitcoin, we've been buying and selling Bitcoin, that's our base currency, and we have been using the United States dollar to fund these transactions. So that is the quote currency. However, another popular currency that you're going to be using inside of Binance is Binance Coin. You may also see this as BNB, and you should be able to see it over in this list. So if we wanted to buy some Binance coin, here's how you would do that. We can buy it using the United States dollar. Now, I kind of have mixed feelings about Binance coin because I kind of feel like it's just a coin Binance is trying to benefit from by forcing it on people. <laughs> but if you use Binance coin, you can actually save some money when you're trading on the Binance platform. So it's not that there's anything wrong with Binance coin, it's just that there's a lot of pressure from Binance to buy this coin. Oh frick, that is a giant spider. Oh gosh. Oh, what do I do? 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 Oh, I got him. Oh, jeez. It's a battle over here. All right, he's definitely not going to survive that one. One of the benefits of owning Binance Coin is that you can save on fees. So, if you go up to these tabs at the top, for one, you're going to see that I'm a total noob here because if you hover over this, you can see it says VIP zero and you can hit that and this is going to bring you to a dashboard here which talks about a little bit on your cryptocurrency portfolio as well as down here there's going to have some stuff about your trading fees and you can see use BNB to pay for fees 25% discount. So if you want to save as much money as possible it's probably best that you have this turned on and you have some Binance coin in your portfolio. So go ahead and buy some. Go to buy crypto, go ahead and buy some Binance coin, and then just put the amount that you want, whatever it might be. Uh, and from the source, you can check your bank account. Now, saving on fees is not the only benefit of owning Binance coin. And for many of you, this next piece is going to be irrelevant, but for me, this is actually a huge thing. So as an online content creator, one of the ways I make money is through referral and affiliate links. And if you were to sign up for Binance using my affiliate link, I get a percentage of the fees for your transactions. Now it doesn't cost any extra to you, just less of it goes to Binance and some of it goes to me. So if you want to understand a little bit more about this, you can get up to 40% of commissions on the people that you refer. So here is my referral code. But if you scroll down, you'll notice my referral rate is 20%. What? You'll also notice that I've earned zero dollars, so I'm doing real good, right? Well, I can actually increase this referral rate to 40% if I hold 500 Binance coin or more. And just to see what that would cost, let's go ahead and try to buy 500 Binance coins. Swap this to the crypto and then Binance coin and we want to buy 500 of them. So this with the current pricing is 8,136 United States dollars. So basically if I really get into the referral program it's in my best interest to own at least 500 Binance coins and just let them sit there in my portfolio. Yes I still have those coins so I could always sell them later but that means I get less from my affiliates. So that's just another interesting thing about the Binance referral program. That being said, of all of the referral programs I know, I think this is one of the best because it's residual, it's not for like a temporary amount of time, and it's not just like a little one-time bonus. A lot of the things I refer people to is like $10 bonus or you know a $5 bonus. I'm even on one referral program that it's a $1.50 bonus. Those are great just to get a little extra money here and then, but I know of people who have actually made a significant amount of money regularly just through referring people to Binance because of that ongoing fee share up to 40%. So enough rambling, but hopefully you understand a little bit more about Binance coin. That's all I got for you guys in this video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the upcoming videos. Let me know what other concepts you want me to cover and what you'd like to see more of. Be sure to subscribe.